today I'm going to be cooking our lunchtime meal, our main meal of the day from the new book River Cottage Much More Veg. So we've only done one recipe out of this so far and that's really really nice so we're going to do some more. Um, so today I'm going to do the Boston Bean and Squash Stew. And that's what it should look like at the end. I've got most of the ingredients we did shop for the ingredients um, there's a couple of things i've changed up that we happen to have in um, or what we like so i'm using these ingredients so i've got some black pepper some mustard some sugar some rapeseed oil a can of chopped tomatoes a can of black beans a can of aduki beans some bouillon to make stock some garlic um, a butternut squash and two onions um, the recipe does say suggest using dried um, black bangers beans, um, but it does say if you uh, don't want to spend an hour or so soaking those or you want to use something else, to use different beans. So I opted for the black beans and aduki beans that we use quite a lot. Um, and what else did I substitute? Um, garlic, we didn't have any fresh bulbs of garlic, so I was using the garlic. Um, and I'm missing out on the molasses and the cocoa or cacao powder and because I don't think we've got any in. If I find any, I'll put some in. So that's the ingredients and uh, I'll get cooking. The first thing I'm going to do is chop up my onions. Um, and I've got a nice big pan to put them in. So I'm just going to chop these up and get them frying in some of the uh, rapeseed oil. Um, While the onions are frying away over there in the pan, I'm going to cut up this um, butternut squash. I'm going to skin it and then um, cut it into cubes, ready to go into the, the pan when the onions are ready. Now the onions are cooked, I'm going to add two teaspoons of sugar and two tablespoons of mustard. Two. And just stir that all together to form a sort of paste before putting it back on the heat. Next up, I'm going to add the um, chunks of squash. Now the uh, squash is in, I'm just going to make up some um, stock. So I've got my bouillon um, powder in there and I'm just adding some boiled water. Just give that a good mix. Add that to the pan. litre of stock and I'm also going to add the um, chopped tomatoes. Give that a good mix up. And then lastly before I let it simmer away for about half an hour I'm just going to add a little bit of thyme and a little bit of garlic. And then I'm just going to turn that down and let that simmer for 30 to 40 minutes.
the squash has been simmering away for about 25 minutes and it's nice and soft now. So I have drained the aduka beans and black beans and put them in this uh, colander. So I'm just going to tip them in now and stir them in and then uh, just wait for them to warm up before we can serve dinner. <laughs> 